Hey guys, welcome to Wrestling Days and welcome to another WWE 2K17 reaction video. Um, there is a new trailer that has just been launched. It's called Welcome to Suplex City. Um, I'll be perfectly honest, I have seen it already. Uh, they showed it at Clash of Champions. They showed it on this week's Raw and uh, I think it's absolutely brilliant. But I wanted to watch it with you guys so that I could just talk about some of my observations um, and also some of the things I would have maybe liked to have seen in there or some of the things I think really work that they've um, done with it. As I say, I think it's absolutely brilliant. Uh, one of the things, just before I start it, one of the things, uh, observations that I have, I think it's really funny how they're using like old pop songs um, as the backdrop to like these kind of violent trailers and violent films at the moment. It's kind of feels like a phase that we're going through. Um, certainly the likes of Guardians of the Galaxy, you know, like the Marvel films, they always tend to have a few kind of old classic upbeat 60s, 70s kind of uh, songs um, that really kind of don't go with the you know, the, the brutal action that's being shown on screen. Um, but to tell the truth, it makes that action seem even more kind of brutal because in the background you've got la 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 <laughs> or you've got something really upbeat. This one is downtown, um, which I think is Petula Clark, but I'm not 100% sure on that. Um, anyway, I'm going off on a tangent. I think the trailer is amazing and you will see slash hear what I mean uh, when we uh, hit play. And uh, well, that's now. So <laughs> let's go and let's enjoy. Welcome to Suplex City. There's the music you can hear. Awesome graphics. Look at that Spinner Rooney in the background. Booker T, Big Show sign, there's Seth. And there's Big Show. And Ultimate Warrior thing on the side of the door. Dead Man, that's obviously The Undertaker's hearse. Shame they couldn't bro kick alone. 2K in the background. It's obviously Alberto Dario. It's all moves shameless. All moves very quickly, see so D, uh, Dolph Ziggler sign on the doors. Dean Ambrose, Dean Ambrose logo behind him. Sheep mask spray Wyatt. We go down into the sewers for the, the main event. It's brutal, isn't it? That's, I'm sure there was a Stone Cold thing. Uh, special buy now, reduced to move, not free. Awesome in it. Absolutely awesome. It's just showing you a bit of gameplay there. So what did you think? I think it's absolutely amazing. You could watch that trailer 50 times and find 50 different things in the background that are connected to different wrestlers and whatnot. The level of detail that has gone into that um, is, is staggering. But the one thing that it, it really made me think is that they should totally make a Suplex City game. Could you imagine like a Grand Theft Auto game um, using like wrestlers instead of like um, civilians and you've still got to complete missions and all of that but you're going around Suplex City can you imagine that I mean like it, it works I really think WWE could do something with this as well um, I'm not saying like that's it scrap the arenas and you know completely change everything but I just think it's there's, there's something in this there really is something in this, even if it was just a weekly show where you got to see the wrestlers outside of the wrestling uh, world and more in their own natural habitat. I think uh, the response to the recent Heath Slater 
um, kind of, uh, you know, where he's in the trailer with Rhino and Renee Young, uh, that got a fantastic response. And also they've done this year, um, The New Day and The Wyatts at the Wyatt Compound. Again, that got a great response as well. I just think that they could do that kind of thing on a more regular basis, maybe give it its own show um, and really build up this kind of idea of a community, a wrestling community outside of the arenas and they could further storylines with it and I just I know I might be going OTT for, you know, just a trailer for a game and it was only like one minute forty two long. But I just I, I loved it. I absolutely loved it. I love the fact that you've got, you know, Seamus has got his own bar and you go down in the sewer and that's where like the underground fighting happens and of course that's where Brock Lesnar lives it's, it's wicked it's absolutely wicked all, all these things keep doing is just getting me more and more excited for the game so yeah man amazing love it um, I'd love to know your thoughts uh, drop it in the comments below um, if you liked this reaction video give it a like um, and uh, if you haven't subscribed yet, I really would appreciate it if you would, could, because um, we're only a few weeks away from the game coming out, and I am going to be all over that thing, let me tell you. Um, yeah, awesome. Thanks a lot for watching, guys. Um, hope you enjoyed it, and hopefully I'll see you again next time. Bye for now.